Good evening, YouTube, and welcome to another edition of the Gentleman's Corner. And tonight I have a uh, online friend here, Mr. I Goose. How are you doing today? I'm doing great, man. Thanks for having me on. Uh, now, before we get started with the questions, I do want to give everybody a reminder that if you have any questions that you want me to ask future guests, make sure that you put them in the description, or excuse me, in the comments below. Or if you want other people to be guests, make sure you put their name in the uh, comments below, and I'll, I'll try and reach out to them to try and get them on. Uh, but with that being said, we'll we'll go ahead and get started with with the questions here. You all right? right? All right. Yeah, so I'm ready, man. Some of these questions are standard. Some are, I reuse or change a little bit, just depending on the situation. Uh, but we'll go ahead and get started with the first question, which is, what or who inspired you to YouTube, and why? Um. Okay. Um. Well, first of all, I want to say thank you for very much for having me on. Like I said, this is one of my favorite. You know, kind of. Uh, series going on YouTube right now. I love this. It's, it's kind of just, you know, get to know the person a little bit better. So thank you, thank you, thank you for having me on. I really appreciate that. No problem. Thank you for coming. And thank you. And um, okay, so the question is, who or what inspired me to get into YouTube? Okay. Um, well, the reason why I got into YouTube, like mainly for Call of Duty, you know, aspect is uh, the clan I was in during Modern Warfare 3 on PS3. Uh, you know, there a lot of them had like really good game clips and stuff like that, but um, nobody ever had any recording equipment, anything like that. But one of the other guys, you know, he kind of got the HD PVR, started uploading. And I said, well, you know what? I would like to do that. And so I, you know, researched around and ended up picking up the Elgato. And then, but what really inspired me, that's kind of what got me into it. But what inspired me is this guy, Benty2595. I'm not sure if anybody really knows, you know, I'm, I'm sure a lot, of, a lot of people know who he is. I'm not sure if you know who he is. Um, he doesn't really upload anymore. Um, but he, he did this thing where it was like, it was shout out Sundays. That's kind of how I met everybody, like Serial Assassin, uh, Rudd Dog, uh, mm -hmm. the Swans. They all did, you know, shout out Sundays through Benty2595. And that's pretty much who inspired me to actually do commentaries and stuff like that. Okay. All right. Um, what would you say is your dream career? Huh. Winning the lottery and never fucking working ever again. <laughs> that's a good career. That's, that's, that's probably my dream career. All right, let's say that you can't win the lottery and you actually have to do something. Even even if the, the pay just doesn't matter, what would be your dream career? Um, my dream career? It'd probably be like something working around golf. Um, maybe being like a like a golf instructor or, you know, maybe owning a golf course, something like that. All right. Golf, golf's a big passion of mine, so. It'd awesome. be, something, be something around golf. Yeah, the only golf I can play is Mario Golf, so. <laughs> <laughs> I, never, I never played that. Um, what would you say is your favorite insult? My favorite insult? Yeah. Um, well, my favorite insult, like playing video games, when someone calls me like a kid, you know, because like, you know, if they hear me talking on the mic, which is a rare occasion, but, you know, they're like, you're like old, man. You're like, well, how old are you, like 40, 50, you know? That to me is the funniest thing in the world because it's like, yeah, okay, I'm like 35 years old. Uh, you know, I have a wife and kids, and, you know, they're sleeping. I'm on playing video games. You're, what, 18, 19 years old? What the fuck are you doing on here? You know what I mean? Like, right. Go out and, you know, go party, do something. That's kind of my favorite insult to me. It's kind of turning around on them. Yeah, exactly. All right. Uh, what is a bad movie that you like anyway? It's a terrible movie, but you, you know it's terrible. You still love it. Um, let me try to think about this one. I, I don't know. I mean, I hear... I, the only reason why people I, people think this is a, like a bad movie, maybe got into my mind that's a bad movie, is Step Brothers. I actually love that movie. I watch it <laughs> nonstop. But but there's some people like like my brother, my brother in law, they freaking hate that movie. But I love that movie, so that's probably Step Brothers. Yeah, uh, Pab's gonna kill me for this, but to this day I still haven't seen that movie all the way through. That was his favorite movie, by the way. <laughs> oh, was it? Yeah, yeah. yeah I, I love Step Brothers, but for some reason my family hates it. I don't know. Uh, I'll have to I'll have to give it a shot one of these it's, days. It's a funny, funny movie, man. Uh, what is something that's illegal but you think should be legal? Uh, illegal but should be illegal. Mm -hmm. huh. Damn. I don't do drugs or anything like that, so I don't really want any drugs legalized. That doesn't really affect my life. Right. I'm trying to think. Um... Prostitution? I don't. <laughs> I don't know. Yeah. I, I mean, if it's go. controlled, why not, right? Yeah, let's go with that. Okay. 
Um, outside of YouTube, do you have any personal goals for like the next year, the next 12 months? Um, outside of YouTube? Yeah, like mainly like work goals and stuff like that. Uh, you know, the main things I'm trying to do is, you know, um, you know, move ahead in my career at work, uh, move mm -hmm. up the kind of ladder, uh, make a little bit more money. That's what we pay, pay off bills. And we're, you know, we're trying to buy a new house. Actually, you know, our goal is to have a, have a new house by the end of next summer. So that's kind of a big goal, saving tons of money, working, working a ton. I, I mean, I'm always saying in my videos, eh, it's got through work and I'm always freaking working. So yeah, that's probably my goal. Big goal is buy, uh, buy a brand new house at the end of next summer. Yeah. You know, you know, it's funny is I've asked that question just outside of this to other people. And it's amazing what 10 years of a difference will do when you ask that question. Like, oh, yeah, <laughs> my, my goal is the same thing. I want to sell the house that I'm, I actually want a little bit of a smaller house, but a nicer one. Yeah. But yeah, you, you have somebody who's like 25, that same question. And the answers are completely different. Yeah. Well, we got, we got, you know, we got a, a family, got wife and kids, you right, know, they, right. they're kind of number one. Sure. Uh, what would you say is the theme song for your life? Hmm. Theme song for my life? Yeah. Damn, I've never heard you ask that question before. Hold on. It's not on my notes anywhere. <laughs> uh, oh, shit. That's a new one. Uh, I threw a twist in there. Yeah, you did. Um, let's see, I don't listen to a whole lot of music. Uh, I do listen to music, but mainly stuff that I upload, like, just like, without, like, song or anything like that. Mm -hmm. Um... Hmm. Even if it's just a favorite song or something. Yeah, I'm trying to think. God, dude, well, you stumped me there, damn it. Ha <laughs> <laughs> ha. song about my life. Fuck. Um. How about this? We'll go to the next question if you think about yeah, it. Yeah, yeah, let's do that because, I mean, I, try, I just can't even think about it right now. All right, no reason. problem. Uh, next question is, if you were president, who would be your vice president? Hmm. Get to the, you know, the questions where I actually fucking have to think now. Uh, <laughs> probably who would be my, my vice president would be uh, probably my wife. Okay. Yeah. Now, probably the sec wife. second part of that question is if it was a woman. But since she's named a woman, what about if it was a man, if it had to be a man? If it was a guy? Mm-hmm. Be, uh... Hmm. Arnold Schwarzenegger. <laughs> <laughs> Cause he he can't he can't be vice president so. I, I would love I would love for him to be the VP and tell the president to get to the chopper. <laughs> yeah, there you go. <laughs> uh, all right, are you a, are you a hamburger or a hot dog man? And explain yourself. I'm a hot dog guy, and uh, the reason why is I don't know for some reason every time I go to a barbecue I like the burnt you know like. Oh those, yeah, the crispy. The burnt, yeah, the crispy hot dogs. I just for some reason when people try to barbecue hamburgers this. Yeah, it's like, eh, I go for the safe route, go for the hot dog, even though it sounds fucking weird, but it's true. I just, I just, you know, I enjoy the hot dogs. You ever had a deep fried hot dog? I never have, no. You should try I've, one. I've seen them on Food Network. I have seen them on Food Network. All right. Diners, drive-ins, and dives. Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, all right, so this question is the one that most people look forward to, which is the murder, bang, or marry question. Right. And this is the uh, presidential daughter's edition. Oh shit! <laughs> so your choices can are I murder. Can I murder all of them? <laughs> your, your choices are Chelsea Clinton, Jenna yeah. Bush, or Barbara Pierce Bush, which is the Jeez. other. Twins. <laughs> all right. First of all, I'd bang all of them before I did anything. <laughs> you it's... can't do that. You got to oh, choose one do that? for each. Oh, okay. no, no, no. All right. So I'd, I would, uh, I, I'd murder Chelsea Clinton, and I'd probably. What were the two Bush daughters? What was it? Jenna Bush and Barbara Pierce Bush. Oh, okay. I would uh, bang Jenna and marry Barbara P Barbara P Barbara P Pierce, whatever her name is. Okay. All right. Um, all right. So let's 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 swing back to the question that you didn't uh, answer yet. I didn't even what answer it yet. What is the theme uh, song? Okay. Um, I listen to like a, a huge variety of music, and uh, the theme, probably the song I could best think of. I don't know if you listen to George Strait. You heard of him a lot. I used to actually be big into country music when I was younger, right. and uh, I used to sing a lot and all that stuff. But um, "Amarillo by Morning" by George Strait. If you haven't heard that song, just listen to it. It's kind okay. of about you know the kind of guy that just works his ass off and uh, kind of a kind of a loner, you know. 
Okay, I'll put a link in the description if I can find it on YouTube. Find it, yeah, man. Yeah. It's yeah, I spent the only thought, song I could think of in short notice. Not a problem. Well, all right. Well, I do want to thank you for taking some time out of your day to to do this interview. Um, I'll have a link to your channel in the description as well. And if uh, if anybody wants to check out uh, I Goose, I highly recommend it. He's he's a great commentator, puts up good content, and the gameplay you've been watching is uh, Mr. I Goose's. So I uh, I do want to. Yeah. No problem. I want to thank you for visiting the Gentleman's Corner, and have a good evening. All right, you too. Thank you very much. Peace no out. Peace out.